What's up everybody, Wandering the Wasteland is finally upon us again with Fallout 4, but unfortunately for some of us, so are the inevitable glitches. Today we'll be doing a simple glitch fix for the unlikely Valentine quest at the point where you reach Vault 114 to rescue Detective Valentine and the door will not open. So as you can see, when I look at this rad stag, Vats isn't coming up as I hit the button. That has something to do with the glitch at 114. So what you want to do is load up your game right before you get to Vault 114 if you have one. Hopefully you do. And make sure that it's loaded before you attempt to go through the vault door. So once you're loaded up, walk over to the door and definitely do not touch that button because it has something to do with the glitch and it messes up your vats. So the first thing you want to do is pull up your console command using the asterisk key and type in TCL collision off in parentheses. And this enables you to walk through walls and all that. Shut it off by hitting the asterisk key and walk through the vault door. Get to a good spot and pull up the console command again and type in TCL collision on in parentheses this time. Now you're inside the vault, and if you attempted to activate the vault door before doing this, you'll notice that VATS won't work. But since we bypassed that button, VATS is working perfectly and you should be able to continue on with the quest as normal. So fight your way through the trigger man and rescue Detective Valentine, and obviously the only way out of any vault is through the vault door. So once you and Valentine make your way back to the front of the vault, just repeat these two console commands and walk back through the vault door. You won't see Valentine right away, but no worries. Continue ahead to the metro tracks and off to the right walk through the rusty metal door. Go up the stairs to the manhole and load into the common wasteland. Once you're loaded in, just wait a few seconds and Detective Valentine should pop up and that'll be the end of your quest. I hope this helped a lot of you guys that were having the same problem as me. I definitely didn't like the idea of playing through the game without VATS anymore. Not to mention being unable to finish a main story quest because of this vault glitch. So give this a try guys and let me know what happens in the comments. Also feel free to let me know any other methods of fixing this glitch or reasons as to why this glitch happens. Um, most importantly thanks for watching and have fun exploring the wastelands of Fallout 4. Later.